And we begin with breaking news, a shot of hope for Kern County, quite literally. COVID vaccines have arrived in the Golden Empire. Our 17's Aton Wallace joins us live inside Kern Medical, where the first vaccine is set to be administered any moment. Let's take it over to him. Yeah, the first shipment of these Pfizer vaccines arrived this morning, and now we are inside the A wing here at Kern Medical, where in just a few moments, Dr. Raj Haydari, he is the director of infectious disease fellowship here at Kern Medical. He is going to receive the first. He's going to be the first person to receive the first shot here in Kern County. In the meantime, let's take it over to Dr. Royce Johnson here of Kern. about the safety and the apparent efficacy of the vaccine. There may be some bumps in the road as we go forward as trying to uh, eradicate this virus. It does require significant participation from a large segment of the population to make that happen. So I hope everyone will understand that we, at this point in history, view this vaccine as being safe and effective. Uh, I can't tell you for sure that there wouldn't be some long-term consequences. But I have really no doubt that the long-term consequences, if any, are going to pale by comparison to what we have going on in our community today. So with that, uh, thank you very much. A wing here where we're just waiting for Dr. Arash Haydari. He's the director of infectious disease fellowship here at Kern Medical. He is going to be the first person in Kern County to receive that vaccine. They're just moving, moving the podium here. I spoke to Dr. Haydari just a few moments ago. He says that he is definitely uh, looking forward to receiving this vaccine. He has been at the forefront of treating coronavirus. He told me since March and he wants to make a public example here. He's the first he volunteered. He wants to be a public example to say, hey, this vaccine is safe. And here he is. You see him there. He is about to receive the vaccine here. He's lifting up. There you see his left arm. Again, Dr. Arash Haydari, he's the director of the Infectious Disease Fellowship here at Kern Medical, ready to receive that first vaccine in Kern County. Let's listen in. Dr. Jeff Jonathan, senior pharmacist. Hi, everybody. Jeff. Hi, Jeff. Hi, Jeff. <laughs> I just want to say uh, it is an honor and privilege to get Dr. Jerry back in today. I'm still going to get our soil here in Kern County. We've been the one to step up and we went to South Station for residents of FC. This guy has been a true hero to the community. And it is my honor to be here back in today. Thank you. Thank Director of Infectious Disease Fellowship here at Kern Medical. Now, in total, this first shipment, Dr. Haydari says, is about 2,000 uh, doses here at Kern Medical, about 5,800 or so, just over 5,800 in Kern County in total. Now, this is a Pfizer vaccine, and the Pfizer vaccine, as a reminder, is a two shot vaccine. That means Dr. Haydari and everyone else who will receive this vaccine, they're going to get it a first time, and then to ensure 
effectiveness. They must get it in 21 days, and then they believe in 28 days after that first shot, you will reach immunity. That's what Dr. Haydari told me just before coming on the news at noon. Now, tonight on 17 News at 5, I will have reaction not just from Kern Medical, but from the other hospitals as well, Adventist Health and Dignity Health here in Kern County. They, too, receiving the vaccines today. We'll have that at 5. In the meantime, let's send it back to you, Nicole. All right, thanks, Aton. We'll check back in with you later. Well, other hospitals across Kern County are also receiving shipments of the vaccine. This morning, Adventist Health Bakersfield gave us an up-close look at the COVID-19 vaccine as they got them off the truck and loaded them into their freezer. Adventist Health received roughly 1,500 vaccines to be administered for healthcare workers, and even more shipments are expected in the coming days. And Dignity Health has received their first shipment of the COVID-19 vaccine. The hospital says they will begin administering the shots to hospital workers as soon as just in a couple of hours. Public Health has also received their shipment of the vaccine.